Hello students, this is yet another good question on number system in class 9th chapter number 1. So the question goes like this, if a square b cube and c raised to power 4 is equal to 49,392, where a, b, c are distinct positive prime numbers, c just see distinct, that means a is not b, a cannot be equal to b and b cannot be equal to c, they are different numbers. So they are distinct and positive prime numbers. Another important thing is that look at these are prime numbers. So what we do is this quantity that has been given to us, if we make prime factors of this, undoubtedly, undoubtedly, you will have them as A, B and C. And looking at the powers of those numbers, the looking at the powers of the prime factors, we will be able to see which one is A, which one is B and which one is C. So 49,000. 392 you definitely must be knowing how to make the prime factors start dividing it by 2 and then keep on going then by the next higher number and like this so that I am not doing it here but I am telling you uh, you will definitely get this is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into uh, 3 into 3 into 7 into 7 into 7 when you make prime factors you will definitely get these prime factors now this can be written as 2 raised to power 4 and uh, 3 raised to power 2 and 7 raised to power 3 and this is uh, let me write it like this c raised to power 4 and a raised to power 2 and b raised to power 3. So corresponding positions I have just written, this could be written as it is also, A into B into C also. But I have written A that this is corresponding to this and this is corresponding to this. And that number corresponds to this. Just by comparing the powers you can see here, B is undoubtedly 7 and 2, A is 3. Here we have A raised to power 2, there we have 3 raised to power 2. That means A is, here we have uh, B raised to power 3, there we have 7 raised to power 3. That means B is 7 and C. C raised to power 4, there 2 raised to power 4. So C is 2. A is 3. A is 3, same powers 2, 2. B is, I said 7, power 3, 7 raised to power 3. And C, we know, raised to power 4 and 2 raised to power 4. So this is how. It's a very simple question, but usually sometimes uh, we uh, at the time of solving it does not click to our mind. So as to how to go about. So distinct positive prime numbers. Here is the hint given. Prime numbers. So this given quantity to be made into prime factors of prime numbers, and they are different. That means you cannot have b is equal to a is equal to c. And we have seen one is two, another is three, another is seven. So they are distinct, and they are also prime factors. Thereafter we have raised the powers accordingly and then on comparing we have found that A is 3, B is 7 and C is 2.